drinking, no drinking, no drinking, no drinking, no drinking. They're dead. Let's go to the village. Hey, So this is Great Mazuri's village. First, we must talk with the village elder. Everyone follow the Great Mazuri. Look at that, okay? The Great Gabrao is currently having a very important discussion. Might I ask you to come back later? Oh, same monster one again. Too bad. I guess we could take a look around the village while we wait. I agree. I'm interested in how people live their lives here. I'd like to talk to as many as I can. You'll be invited to stop by the Great Mizuki's place. Okay, let's go then. Let's have fun, let's have some fun. What is this thing? That's cool, even though that's kind of called laziness. Just tap it more. Charming. 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 This place is protected by a force, force field made by our ancestors. They were great wizards, so we don't fear the powers of darkness. Even though they may come here, they won't be able to get in, so we're not worried. Mizuti? When did you come back? My great Mizuti has just returned! Oh, I'm fine. I heard you had a hard time up there. Holy Everything shit. okay? The great Mizuti be in the oh darkness. Goodness. As well as invincible, incredible, and insurmountable. Yup, that's the Mizuti I know. <laughs> Key, you must be happy. Mizuri's back. Now you have someone to save you from the big bad bullies, sissy boy. Hey, you got your love. It's okay, Mizuri. <laughs> I don't mind. You don't. No. Okay, the great Mizuki has some important business and must go. Oh my god, I can't help but can't take their masses seriously. Okay, tell me about your adventures when you have time. Slow over at the church right quick. Still boss. This is here. Subrest is here. Just hate it when they find your face and stuff. I just missed that little detail, did I? I thought he usually tells me what I usually say. So you back, huh?
cute ass son of a bitch. Camera number three. Let's go back to the adventure. Let's get a shot for a TM. Yeah, you killed that motherfucker. What Whoa. The, uh... What the? There's no one in the shop. <laughs> this building is a total wreck. I wonder if that's why they're not open. There's no point in waiting around here for something to happen. Let's leave. There's no shop. You sure there's no shop? How can he stop this from him? He's to be destroying him, they're gonna kill him. That's her ex-husband. Here you go, ma'am. Third wife. Promised Land. Hmm, if you ever go to the Garden of Death, please be careful. It used to be a very beautiful garden, now it's called the Garden of Death, and for a good reason. Snap from the, for the foreign trees has mixed with the mud, and now it covers the entire garden. If you can find a path with a foothold, it'd be okay, but if not, you'll be, it'll be very difficult to proceed. Hmm. Ah! Damn it! Don't cut off on me! Do not cut off on me! That's the goddess of a job duty. Collecting stuff, collecting stuff, collecting animals all day. Excuse me, young lady. Could I have a look at that pendant you're wearing? Mm -hmm. Of course. Thank you. Very interesting. Have you folks ever heard of an ancient artifact called the Earth Sphere? Mizuti's ancestors, the great wizards of old, made it to seal the bodies of the dead gods within the five islands. I believe that pendant of yours is the Earth Sphere itself, yet it seems to have been shattered. So what you have there is actually only a piece of the Earth Sphere. So this is the Earth Sphere. Two hundred years ago, a man named Calbrand came down from the sky. He stole the Earth Sphere from us and took it back to the sky with him. It must have been owned by a great many people through the ages, yet here it is again, back in our lands. A twist of fate, perhaps. Lord Calbrand's ancestor? He stole the Earth Sphere? I guess since Lord Calbrand's ancestor stole it, it was stored at the Duke's Manor for quite a while. Then Melodia must have found it there, and secretly passed it on to Gelderblame. Then you swiped it from him. It makes sense now. 
So the Earth Sphere was used to seal the gods' parts as N Magnus deep underground. It's all Which is why it could also be used to awaken them. Young lady, even though it may be broken, the sphere is still a very sacred artifact. It may prove useful to you someday. Please keep it safe. Yes. Yes, I will. About a year ago, our elder, the great Camro, had a vision. It foretold the rebirth of an evil god. Ever since then, we've been paying a great deal of attention to the nations of the sky. As the seals of the end magnus were broken one by one, even down here beneath the tank clouds, we could feel an evil power brewing. We no longer wield the power held by the great wizards of old. There was little we could do to stop such an evil from resurfacing. Mizuti must have overheard the adults talking about it, and set off immediately trying to save the world alone. Wow, to save the world alone? That's pretty reckless for a great Mizuti. Oh, this is where well. are you travelers? I bet you come from the sky to buy something unusual here, didn't you? I'm sorry to tell you this, but there's no clerk in the village shop. I'm actually one of the clerks, and look at me, I'm just standing here spacing out with nothing to do. If you go into the shop already, you can see what a mess it is, in a, in a pretty poor, it's in pretty poor condition. There's this material called rubber mud that can be found in the burning of death. I can reinforce the damaged parts and reopen the shop if I had lost it. I'm too afraid to go there myself, and I doubt anyone kind enough to go all the way out there to get the mud for me. So having said that, you should forget about shopping in this village. child has returned to us safely. Of course. Mizuti just couldn't sit still after finding out that something terrible was happening to the world involving the earth sphere stolen from our ancestors. Besides, considering what Mizuti has accomplished, I am truly impressed. I am proud of the kid. Ditto. Ditto. There you go again. You're spoiling our child, you know. Anyway, I'm so happy to see you home safe. Welcome back, Mizuti. Good to be back home, dear mother. So, all this really happened up here. To tell you the truth, Mizuti is the most powerful wizard in this village. Holy crap, really? Perhaps Mizuti was much more sensitive to the dangers up above than any of us were. About a month ago, 
Mizuti said someone needs to check on the outside world. And just flat out left. We were <laughs> so worried. But <laughs> our child is back home <laughs> again, safe and sound, thanks to all of you. Our apologies for any mischief Mizuti may have caused you. Oh no, don't mention it. The great Mizuti saved the day more than once. The great Mizuti? Mizuti, you're not calling yourself great again, are you? Stupid moth is in here. Well, um... Mizuti! How many times do I have to tell you? A truly great person would never show off his importance. <laughs> come now, come now. It's been a while since we last got together as a family. I wouldn't be so picky. On the other hand, Mizuri, your mother is right in a way. I wouldn't feel comfortable calling myself the Great Call. It's just not polite. Kaka, what has been taken? Speaking of great, have you had a chance to talk with the Great Kamro? He was really worried about you. Boy, you should go so let cute. him know you're safe. But the Great Kamro, he'd be having an important discussion. An important discussion? Ah, I think I know who he's talking with. I heard Sir Crumley's in town. If it's him, their talk shouldn't last too long. I don't think they have much to discuss. Uh-huh. Understood. But you don't need to force a cuddle. Yes, you go along and do that. Behave yourself when you talk to the great Kamaro. You hear me? Of course. Okay, let's go, everyone. Follow the way around. We don't know here. <laughs> True. Next village have been dreaming dreaming about immigrating to the world above. There's a rumor that, that when the Earth Spirit was stolen two centuries ago, they were somehow involved. I heard they tried to change the situation. Oh, it's just a rumor though. I wonder if old Krimi from the next village is still talking with the great Kamua. There are people who those people want to abandon their duty as guardians and get out from under the tank clouds. I understand how they feel. He always argues with the great Kamor. Why can't he discuss matters in a more civilized manner? Oh, let's see, there's gonna be more bad guys we're gonna be talking to in this village.
there a secret way to get up there? sleep at night. The great Camro is having a bit Camro, you intend for us to rot down here in the Clouds. Now that the evil god is awake, what is the point of sitting here for nothing? I've waited long enough. That old goat. He has no clue whatsoever. That's a big one. That is Sir Crumley, chief of a neighboring village. Please don't mind him. He always gets worked up like that when talking with the Great Camero. Their discussion seems to be over. The Great Camero will see you now. Holy crap! Let's see, it says start at the top left corner. Then take the teleporter to the right, to the right of the palace. Take the one no, take the one on the second level to the left. This one? Nope. Okay, it was the top left one. to the right 
of a palace. Now take the one on the second level to the left. So this is part of the four level. Finally take the one to the right on the second level. Okay. Now let's talk to their great master or great whatever his name is. Yes. Yes, my name is James. Is this he? The great Kamro? Welcome home, Missouri. It must have been awful for you up there in the sky. Your efforts are appreciated. Oh my god, he's got the scariest mask. No problem. Anytime. Piece of cake. People of the sky, I bid you welcome to the village of Genma. It seems you've taken good care of our Masudi. Please accept my thanks. No, no. Thank you. Thank you for helping us out of that tight spot the other day. Mizuti called to us, so we hastily attempted a sealing spell. Yet, the power of the evil god was immense. Honestly speaking, I was unsure what would become of us. Without your help, we'd have been killed by Mel Percio for sure. Thank you so much. It was the least we could do. As you must know from seeing our village, we no longer possess the powers once wielded by the wizards of old. A thousand years have passed since our people started living in these poisonous conditions. Devastated from battles with the gods, our magic has all but withered away. As I'm sure you recall from your confrontation with Malpercio, even the combined power of our villages did little more than slow the creature down. Many of us collapsed after the effort. Regretfully, we no longer have the power nor the will as a people to leave the taint clouds and face Malpercio. But Mizuri is a very strong child with potential rivaling that of the ancient wizards. It's almost as if Mizuti were one of our ancestors reincarnate. Perhaps this potential is why the child has always been somewhat different from the others in our village. I'd say it was a blessing in disguise for her to have gone up there and found all of you. Although facing great dangers in the sky, she needs companions such as you to help develop her potential. She? They're the man or the only ones who jumped. You mean the great Mizuti is a she? Oh, you didn't know? Learn something new every day. According to one of our village legends, a thousand years ago, our ancestors used three sacred artifacts to defeat the gods. The Sword of the Heavens, the Ocean Mirror, and the Earth Sphere. The Sword of the Heavens, the Ocean Mirror, and the Earth Sphere. And the Ocean Mirror is... The Ocean Mirror was given to the people of the Icelands by our ancestors. It's been shattered, and the Earth Sphere is in pieces. The fuck a bar you were with, with us when we got the sucker. But the third artifact, 
the sword of the heavens is still safe here in our lands. It should prove a great help when facing Mount Persia, as it was against the gods some thousand years ago. Where can we find the sword of the heavens? It is kept in the Garden of Death, just north of this village. Here, take this key. Use it to unlock a door deep within the garden. All right, let's go down there and get the sword of the... Callus. <clears throat> you seem to have a mysterious friend with you. Yeah, he seemed vicious when he it said... It is a pleasure <laughs> making your acquaintance. The children of the Earth welcome you, brave spirit. Nice to meet you. You have fought courageously side by side with your friends from the sky. Please strive on, so that the world may not fall into darkness. Callus, you and your spirit friend just may be the key to restoring our world. Huh? Hmm. You should go now. Please be careful. What's that supposed to mean? So am I gonna die? Oh, so one more thing, Callus. Those standing behind me are the keepers of the children of the Earth lore. Their tales of this world may pass, uh, world's past may be of interest for you. After all, our current struggles are also battles against our own past. We can do it next time. Okay guys, gonna save here. Next part we'll hear the stories and then we go to the full